I used to be so angry and I'll just come out and smack the bag. But you know what? I learned how to transmute the anger because I leaned into the energy of the anger. Okay, so when the anger come up, I'd really lean into the energy of it. Like I fully accepted that, yeah, actually, I feel angry right now. That was the biggest thing, was fully accepting it. Because you know when you feel angry and you're just like, nah, fuck that, I don't want to feel it. How I transmuted it and shifted it was like full acceptance. Like literally, I was like, all right, right now I'm feeling the anger. I'm going to lean right into that and experience it. So I leaned into it. And instead of like going how I used to, I'll go to the bag and I'll just like, you know, smash it out in the bag. Instead of doing that, I started just like leaning and tapping straight into the emotion as it come up. Like I'd lean into how it would feel inside my chest, sit present with it, and it would shift. It would shift so quick. And then I learned to do that with grief, and that's how I transmuted the grief. And I'm not saying I don't cry anymore if I'm really, really like missing my son, but it's different. Like the other day I was driving, for example, and I just felt real sad and I was really missing Luke physically. Okay, and I felt real sad. So I just pulled over and I cried, but I cried for like five minutes because it shifted. So when we bring our full awareness, my friends, to the emotion, the energy, look at it like energy. When we bring our full awareness into that, tap straight into it. Lean into it, accept it, accept this is what it is right now. Pay it all your attention. Look at it as like it's a young child. Look at that emotion, that energy, like it's a young child that needs attention. And you give it your full attention. I promise you it will shift so quick. That's what I'm trying to say. This is how you slide out of suffering. We don't need to suffer. I suffered for years with grief. I suffered for years with internalized anger. It kept coming up. I kept feeding it. I get on the bag. I feed it. I was tired of training like that. I love training. I love getting on the bag and doing the mixed art, martial arts. But I was tired of when I'd feel angry, going to the bag, continuously flogging the bag. I was fucking tired of it. As a woman too, going on the bag all the time. Every time the anger would come up. But I learned I don't have to do it that way anymore. I don't need to release it like that. What worked for me is to lean into it, lean into the emotion. And that's how it shifted. And I encourage you to give it a go. Just give it a go and see if it works for you. Okay? See if it works for you. Because the earth is shifting right now, my friends. And we don't need to hold on to all the old energetics that we've been holding on to from a very young age. A lot of us had held on to grief. A lot of us has held on to anger, shame, guilt, fear from childhood. Even past lives, we brought the shit forward with us from past lives. We don't need to hold on to any of that anymore. We can transmute it. We can let it go. We can set ourselves free. We can set ourselves free. We're not the ego. We're not the mind. Okay? We're not the emotions. We're spirit embodied in a beautiful physical body having this human experience. And how we elevate and raise our vibration and how we shift is pure awareness. You are consciousness, your pure awareness. When you really learn who you are, when you spend time with you and understand you and understand how your body works, observe your mind, observe every thought that goes by. You transcend, you elevate, you levitate. Meditate so you can levitate. Spend every day, every moment of your day in presence. When you're present, you are in a constant state of meditation. When you're in a constant state of meditation, whatever comes up for you, whatever emotions coming up for you, someone's triggering you, someone's annoying you, whatever it is, you're so present. Your mind's not going to get involved and pull you into that suffering and pull you into deep into that emotion. It'll come up, it'll pass real quick. So give this a go today, my beautiful friends, okay? Till next time, stay blessed, stay loved, stay present. Watch and feel and experience your own internal shift. Bless you.